Good evening, everybody. It is such a pleasure for me to be here to be able to speak to you. A little bit to introduce myself. My name is Matouš Janák. I am almost 20 years old. I am studying pharmaceutical science and drug development in the first year. And I'm also current re class representative of the class. In my past, I was junior ambassador of European Parliament. I was also representing people in need, their project One Plan for All in Brussels in 2022. And I was also vice president of the student parliament for four years in my previous school. Uh, if elected, I some six the main points that I have in my campaign, which is support students' opportunities, promoting mental health, improving campus and starting the canteen, then one that I symbolically called stream of consciousness, then the European Union and the strong voice as you probably heard before. To start with the opportunities, I want to ensure that every student that study here would be able to study and then be sure that he can pay the rent for the next month, that he can have the roof over his head. So for that, I want to share more information about Students Assistance Fund, as you probably heard before, is found for the staffs as rents and so on. But the fund cannot cover all of the 8,000 students and more. So I also want to start cooperations with companies from town and town itself to ensure that students will get offers for their part-time jobs or seasonal jobs from the first end, from the hands of the companies itself here at our school. The next is mental health, because at least from my opinion, health and mental health is the most important thing that we have in our lives. And uh, these years is kind of getting harder and harder to keep it in a good condition. And when you seek for help, it's sometimes taking quite a long time. Like in our school is student healthcare center, but if I'm ever right, it has one advisor now. So I want to improve that, but I also want to start a completely new project. It will be a, something like chatting platform, when students can anonymously chat about their problems with the students from their row. But they wouldn't know that, but they would somehow know that the people on the other side could be in a similar situation as they are. So it could help them with speaking about their problems. Also, when you, have, when you want to feel good, you have to feel good in your surrounding. That's why I want to improve the campus itself starting with the camp canteen, because I realized that there is some days where you, there is only meat for the main courses. I want to ensure that every student will have their at least one or two non-meat based main courses and be able every day. About the stream of consciousness, I realized that student union and student senate are doing quite a lot for us, but sometimes students don't see it. So I want to ensure that students will get the information what the student union is doing for them exactly as soon as possible so they can get ready for the actions or just be more in touch with the student union itself because as it was said before, it is about the students. About the European Union, I just want to ensure that students know their stuff. They know that there is something more than just Erasmus. They can move to another country for one year, volunteering here to do the right, right thing, for example, for ecology, also learn the new language or just self-realize themselves more and more. About me representing you, if elected. As I said, I have quite a lot of experiences which I, I think that I can offer you. It is important to speak loud and clearly for everybody in the school. I also want to talk more with the students because, let's be honest, students know the best what they need and what they want. So as I like to say to all the students that ask me, how can you do go to the Strasbourg represent Czech Republic? How is it possible? It was not just me, it is students because together students can move mountains and I want to show you how to do it. Thank you very much. Well done, Matos. So we've got one question, and that's how can you ensure students get part-time jobs as stated in your manifesto? Well, firstly, I cannot ensure that every single student will get part-time jobs. I think that's kind of clear. But as I said, I want to start uh, cooperations with the town and the companies from town, so it will be all local. So it could also help the environment in the city. We could clear more or just help some um, companies to grow more. So if, if we can get these cooperations uh, running, there will be from the single hand for the students. So there will be the first who will be offered with the job. 
And I think that the employers would be kind of happy that someone's going to help them. Okay. Thank you very Thank much, you. Matos. That's Matos Janik, our second candidate for president.